Hello students, in this video we shall discuss example number 2 of chapter 10, Work and Energy. That's a chapter of Science, Physics of class 9th. So previous class we did example number 1 and now example number 2 is A porter lifts a luggage of 15 kg from the ground and puts it on his head 1.5 meter above the ground. Calculate the work done by him on the luggage. So we need to find out the work done by the porter. So let's say this is a porter. A porter is a person you will find at railway station who helps you carry the luggage. So let's say this is the porter and this is your luggage. Okay. Now this luggage is putting on his head. The mass of the luggage is 15 kg. And there is a displacement of 1.5 meters. So displacement if I take this point here. This would be the point. This is my displacement. This distance. Which is 1.5 meters. We need to find the work done. So mass of luggage is 15 kg. Displacement is 1.5 meter. The formula for work done is force into displacement. Here the force is not given but we know that force equals to mass into acceleration. Here we will take the acceleration due to gravity into S. So mg mass into acceleration due to gravity into displacement. G the value is actually 9.8 meters per second square. But then here for calculation purpose we will take 10 meters per second square. So mass is 15 kg. Acceleration is 10 meters per second squared. Displacement is 1.5 meters. Now we will just multiply this. 1.5 into 10 is 15. So this will be 15 kgs times 15 here and that's meter square second squared. And then 15 into 15 if you do, you would get 200 25. So that's 225 and we can write the unit as kg and then meter squared uh, second squared but that is all not required because the unit of work done is joules you can take or newton meter. So this would be newton meter or you can write this is equal to 225 joules. That's the work done. Whenever acceleration is not given, you can take it as acceleration due to gravity if you are picking up something and then you can use the same formula of work done which is force into displacement. That's all for now. See you in the next video.